Hi, my name's Mark Friend and I'm a director here at Friend & Grant. Today I want to talk to you about when you have to register for VAT or value added tax. As a startup business, you need to know the rules as failure to register on time can result in not only VAT being assessed on your supplies, but penalties and interest being charged. Being VAT registered for most businesses isn't a choice. It is compulsory when your VATable turnover exceeds the VAT threshold, which currently, in the tax year 2021, is £85,000. VATable turnover includes supplies which are liable to VAT at 0%, 5% and 20%. Crucially, however, your VATable turnover is not necessarily your actual turnover. Your actual turnover may include a number of items which are considered exempt from VAT or outside the scope of UK tax and therefore need to be excluded from the calculation. Items such as the supply of financial services, rental income from properties are also exempt. Sales to customers outside of the EU are outside the scope of UK VAT, for example sales to America. Similarly, if you sell goods and services to an EU business, then this also falls outside the scope of UK VAT and is not included in your turnover figure. Sales, however, to individuals within the EU will still be liable to UK VAT and therefore will be included in your VATable turnover. Complicated? For some businesses, yes, but for most businesses, your actual turnover will equal your VATable turnover. If there is any uncertainty, then we would recommend you call us. So now that we know what is included in VATable turnover, we need to know when you need to register. In broad terms, there are two occasions when you need to register. Firstly, if you know that within 30 days, your supplies are going to exceed the VAT threshold, then you need to register immediately. For most startups, however, this will not be applicable as it may take several months to reach the VAT threshold. The decision as to when you should register is then based on your cumulative turnover over a period of up to 12 months. When you exceed the threshold, you then have 30 days to register. So, for example, if after 10 months your turnover to say 30th of September exceeded the VAT threshold, you would need to register on the 1st of November. Similarly, if you have been trading for three or four years and then your turnover exceeded the VAT threshold during say the 12 months ended 31st of March, then you need to register for VAT on the 1st of May. To reiterate, registration is based on a roll in 12 months and not based on the turnover per your accounts. There are other situations when you will need to register, so again, please seek advice. If you register late, then the following penalties will be shown as per the tax chart. So for example, if, you're not, if it's not more than nine months late, then it's 5%. If it's more than nine months, but not more than 18 months, then the penalty is 10%. And if it's more than 18 months, it's 15%. And that is of the VAT, which would be assessable. Whatever you decide to do, we would strongly recommend that you seek advice on VAT immediately. VAT cannot be ignored. So if this video has triggered concerns or thoughts, then why not arrange a meeting?